My name is Juno, hello and welcome, I'm Lee, the news reviewer, and today we're going to be talking about the debut EP by Sam Fender called Dead Boys. Now, Sam Fender is a musician who I caught at Tiramon Trail back in 2017, uh, was hitting out with some pretty smart indie rock music, and since then, haven't really kept tabs on him all that much, he was pretty much in the same camp as somebody like Declan McKenna, um, and I'd noticed when I went on Spotify, he has been getting quite the traction behind him, uh, I think one of his songs had like 2 million plays so he's uh, definitely uh, exploded quite a fair bit um, but I'm glad to see that um, despite all that push that he's got from all these different sources that he's still not um, diluting his political leanings at all, he's still going for that quite uh, socially aware uh, music and this EP does have some interesting songs on it, um, especially when it comes to the title track Dead Boys has a prelude to it that um, kind of sets the scene, uh, makes everything a bit more, the mood's more melancholic um, and then when it comes to the actual song itself, Dead Boys is um, quite heavy, it's obviously alluding to um, the men who commit suicide um, every year, far far too many and the way that Sam goes about talking about this is, um, I'd say it's quite sensitive, um, it, very mature and I think he's went into it with the right mindset and um, the, the things he talks about like when it comes to like drinking culture is never in a snidey way it's more just kind of like how it's as a, as, as a coping mechanism Um, I also thought um, whenever he mentions just how quick the anniversary's come about how fucking devastating that is just how quickly these new anniversaries come about it was a uh, quite heavy hitting Um, I think that Sam never tries to paint himself as being somebody that's coming with all the answers for it, nor should he, because that's far too much pressure to put on any musician. He's just trying to paint the sort of like futile state of it all, which I thought was pretty admirable. Um, sadly, I don't think he manages to do um, anything like this on the rest of the EP in terms of a very satisfying kind of mix of substance and style. The only other time that he manages to do that is with the song Spice, um, which talks about the drug of the same name. Um, the chorus, I thought, was kind of kind of funny in a way with how it, it goes about like spice up your life just like the spice girls and the popularity of spice girls in the 90s and spice just now i guess is um, a, a, worth, a worthwhile comparison uh, the mix of the guitars and drums on here as well builds this sense of momentum which um, definitely pays off and um, so that's another song that i think that um, kind of shows off and um, this potential that uh, sam's managed to cement on this EP though, I think with the rest of the songs, eh, especially with Pimlin Kardashians, while it does bring up some bits, um, especially about idol worship and just celebrities in general, which I went, oh that's not actually heard anything along those lines before, there's some ones that are very kind of like, you come to expect nowadays, um, about an orange baby and whatnot, um, even the title of the song itself, I'm just kind of like, uh, seen it before in that, um, the performance is pretty standard, just didn't do anything for me, um, and then there's also the song That Sound, it's trying to do a more dream pop state of things, which um, again, well, admirable, I just don't think gets properly developed, don't think Sam's vocals mesh all that well, and um, maybe could have been a bit more sort of hazy that would have like made that mood just sort of just improve tenfold but just doesn't happen and um, so just yeah again that one didn't do much for me either and um, this EP is quite compact about 17 minutes long so it is um, so it goes by quite fast which I think means that um, if I'm gonna ever see Sam really like do well on this potential that he's shown it will have to be with a longer run time and um, where he can kind of like go about all these different topics and maybe some more interesting ways and um, but like I say he does manage to kind of show show off that he has the capabilities to do so like I said with the title track with Spice so it will be interesting to see where he goes and um, from here and um, I would recommend you guys give this a go because like I say it goes by pretty fast um, and I do think that he's doing some stuff that like while well, I say um, has gotten quite a bit of popularity he doesn't feel like he's diluting himself um, too much so give it a go if you if you get the chance and um, in terms of a score I'm thinking a, a, a light six out of 10 and um, if you already listened to it let me know what you make of a favorite song least favorite song uh rating as well um and as always guys thank you for watching stay safe and stay hydrated